To our viewers from the Estadio Beira Rio, located here in Porto Alegre, Brazil, and home to SC Internacional. And here we have Brazil against Costa Rica. This is Peter Drury, and I'm happy to inform you that Jim Beglin has joined me to offer his expertise. Thanks for that, Peter. Hi, everyone. The excitement has really picked up now, and I'm eager for the action to start. Brazil line up in a 4-3-3. Yeah, it's quite simple, Peter, really. With the ball, it's 4-3-3, and without the ball, it becomes 4-5-1. Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? I'm going to pick a defender, Thiago Silva. Uh, a natural athlete for me, with all the characteristics to be at the top of his trade. He's a natural leader too, and sets an example in, in showing great discipline. Uh, arguably, the world's best. <laughs> I wonder whether that has anything to do with you being a defender once upon a time, Jim. Marcel. Fernandinho. William tries to hit, shapes the shoots. A oh, great save, real class. Well, that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage. And it's hoisted clear. Looking to shoot. Neymar crosses into the box. He's got away. Has a hit! He's done very well to get to that. Well, as Tesco, Peter, the keeper, has just received an A-plus grade. Chance to break. So what now? Plays it into the channel. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Casemiro. Forward it goes. Oh, he's not going to get that. A buccaneering run from the defender. He's left his man. Heads it! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Brazil can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Yeah, this has been pretty decisive, no doubt as to who the better side is. Now it's Ruiz. Jean Miranda. Brazil are pressing with energy in the opening moments of the game. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Can he Fernandinho? Plays it long. Danilo. Turns and goes, but shot at goal! Just too much, fractions. Fernandinho probably tried a bit too hard then. He should have relied on technique as opposed to power. It so nearly came off for him. Yeah, he's been at the centre of a lot of things, hasn't he? Uh, mostly good, I should add. Goes for goal! Oh, surely that deserved better. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. It's a great ball. Plays it back. Neymar. It's Neymar! Goal! Brazil! 
Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it. That was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Brazil take the lead, 1-0. Yeah, this is also a chance to see what happens to their level of concentration from here. Tries a through ball. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Brian Ruiz has been found. Danilo. Marcelo. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Looking to force his way through. Long and high towards the flank. Brian Ruiz drives it in. There's been quite a few crosses coming in from that left-hand side. Look, it's the width that's providing this momentum and, and they look set to further exploit. Costa Rica need to respond pretty quickly now to, to snatch this momentum back. Played out to the wing. Name the shot's on! Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. It didn't quite come off on this occasion, but it only needs a gentle tweak. Oh, he really wanted that. But that's the motivation and enthusiasm he shows and the quality he produces. towards the front men oh, well intercepted really alert to the danger Look forward what does he try from here is there any support he might not need it a oh, full-blooded challenge and it had to be Could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. Into the channel. Neymar. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, you could see he was eager to get a shot away, but there was too much flesh and bone in his path. Willian plays it backwards and they'll try again. Now a chance to break. Steered out wide. Brian Ruiz looking to get on the end of this. Coutinho, it's a loose ball, gets it back. Marcelo, so they got the only goal to make it 1-0. Philippe Coutinho, they've scored! A two-goal lead and they're firmly in control. And that is about as cool as they come. He picked his spot expertly. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out, never mind one. There was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement.
Brazil take a two-goal lead and things should be comfortable from here on in. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead or, or close it out. Surely they'll manage one or the other. No, no way through there. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Casemiro. And it's Neymar. Hoists it high. Keylor Navas. And pick that up. And we've reached half-time. Any strong opinions on the first half? Well, it's looking pretty straightforward, Peter. They've got themselves into a, a very good position, so why dither from here when they can repeat their first-half success with a, another show of strength? Brazil sitting pretty here at half-time, 2-0 up. Just back from your break, we've missed very little of the resumption of the second half. Fernandinho. Too strong there. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. Casemiro needed to come up with a better ball. The movement was good, but the pass lacked authority, uh, a cause of mild frustration. Shoots! Ah, that's great defending to cover for the goalkeeper and just get something in the way. Oh, the ball's... And Coutinho! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeper. <laughs> Driving on, he could shoot here. Shoots! Aimed long and direct. Defenders on the back foot. Casemiro battles to win it back. Marcelo goes looking. It's come loose. And it's Casemiro. Marcelo. Costa Rica uh, keeping their men at arm's length here. Yeah, I just think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Wide to the right. Passes it through. Pushes it out wide. Here comes another cross. Brian Ruiz. Back into the middle. Now it's Ruiz. Sh hits one! That's not going to make it. He's gone for it! Oh, terrific run to latch onto it, but the finish is all wrong. Beautifully worked to take the defence out of the picture, but there'll be no rush to see the replay on this. Neymar. Well, they could break here. Oh, good interception. Fernandinho. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself, lovely to see. Lobs it in gently. Look at the defender bombing forward. And the assistant referee has his flag raised for offside. Just, it seems, but just is enough. Danilo. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, and the fact that he's registered, Peter, simply encourages more attention of, um, of a, a closer nature. No complaints about that challenge. Robust but fair. 
Campbell tries lifting it over. He'll have a dip! He scored! Costa Rica are really pouncing on any stray passes in midfield. We're talking seconds from interception to the back of the net. It's counter-attacking heaven. We have got ourselves a game here. Listen, goals change games, and that has changed the whole complexion of this one. They have the momentum now. Firmino goes through the middle. Douglas Costa. Timely intervention. Tries to get it forward quickly. And now they can launch a counter. Gets wrestled off the ball. Casemiro plays it out to the wing. Brazil suddenly appear frail. Yes, from comfort zone to a stage of uncertainty, perhaps. And they can't drift into a carelessness, or, or this could get away from them. Looks to slip it through. Surely, and the finish! Big relief, it just needed better contact. Brazil were again presented with an opportunity to break and look very, very threatening. Looked inevitable. The defence dealt with that really well. Now the pass. Can he put it away? Neymar, Neymar! One of a type! He's brilliant! However they tried to stand in his way, he just was not to be denied. Demonstrated great strength there. I mean, he really had to hold his man off and just create enough room for him to be able to get the shot away. I think it's just top, top play. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Brazil took a two-goal lead and are looking good for the win. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here, because... For me, it's crying out for them to force the issue. Who's ball? Who's going to get that? Looks like a good ball through. Oh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Oh, that just required a bit more oomph to reach its target. Dinks one in. Tries a through ball. Now here's the through ball. Dashing forward at pace. Douglas Costa tries to stroke it through. Tried to play it through. Uh, was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Chip through, and he's cut it out. Casemiro, Philippe Coutinho, Marcelo. Looking to get with it, and the shot! Campbell goes looking, now a chance to break. Casemiro sticks in a foot to win it back. And it's Neymar, looks to slip it through. Neymar, and he just whacks it away. Campbell, aimed long and direct. Philippe Coutinho, it's a good foot in there. Over. Campbell going through. Plays it in. Gets up to head it. It's in. With so little time left. Grandstand finish. Great header. Made it look easy.
Yeah, I just thought he wanted that more than anyone else on the pitch, and it was fully deserved. He gave it everything he had. Touchline, a change about to occur. Costa Rica give themselves a chance of a fairy tale finish. And the through ball is intercepted. Well, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, the idea was right, the delivery wasn't. They can revisit that further on. Brazil just have to run down the clock. Looks to clip it forward. He's had a go! Oh, nearly, but nearly is nothing. That's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. Danilo. Douglas Costa. Paulinho. Ball's loose. Who's getting there? And there goes the final whistle. Brazil have held on. A knife-edge game, a single goal margin, but they have won it. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Yeah, we knew... Fashion. And with that, it's time...